A meteorologist Shane Hinton with your Thursday morning tropical update. We'll start with Tropical Storm Brett, which currently has sustained winds of 70 miles per hour as of the 7 o'clock this morning update. Now that is just shy of a Category 1 hurricane. So could Brett become our first hurricane of the season? It's definitely possible, but right now the National Hurricane Center forecast cone keeps it as a storm as it moves through the Leeward Islands and continues to push out towards the west. It's currently moving west at 15 miles per hour. Now let's talk about Tropical Depression 4. This formed early Thursday morning, and you can see that the National Hurricane Center thinks that it could quickly intensify into a tropical storm at some point on Thursday, maybe even as we make our way toward uh, the late morning, maybe early Thursday afternoon hours. Now, if it does become a named system, this will be called Cindy, and as you can see, this is currently moving west at 12 miles per hour, but is expected to eventually make a turn towards the northwest. We'll have to monitor this if it makes its way even closer to the United States. Now, let's take a look across the entire tropics. We have Tropical Storm Brett and right behind it Tropical Depression 4, which we just spoke about. But then I want to uh, direct your attention to the west coast of Africa. You can see another tropical wave moving out. This could become another tropical system. We'll just have to continue to monitor this over the coming days. Whichever way you look at it, this is a very active start to hurricane season. This is not an Atlantic basin that looks like June. It looks more like August and with well above average sea surface temperatures, not going to be surprised if we see some of these um, systems intensify rather quickly. So we'll continue to monitor all the updates on the tropics here in the KV Weather Center and provide updates on air and online.